In this video, we will simulate connecting the Renogy 30 amp DC-DC MPPT charger to a 12 volt starter battery, a 12 volt lithium house battery, and integrate 100 watts solar charging to the system for dual battery charging. The following other materials will be used for the purposes of this video. 9 inch adapter kit with ring terminal, 4 gauge battery ring cables, Phillips screwdriver, and a socket wrench. Available in 30 amp or 50 amp. The charger runs a complete four stage charging process for non lithium batteries. Due to the particularity of lithium batteries, the charger will keep charging in the boost stage. It ships with a battery temperature sensor, a smart alternator ignition wire, a communication cable, and ring terminal connectors for splicing your cables if needed. You will use the included battery temperature sensor with gel and other lead acid house batteries by connecting to the BTS port and placing the sensor near or on the house battery. Do not use the BTS with lithium house batteries. You will only use the smart ignition cable if you have a smart alternator and you will need to tap into your smart ignition circuit in the driver's ignition fuse blocks. Start by removing the four screws from the faceplate. Identify the neg minus port and then connect the negatives of the starter and house battery to this port using four gauge battery cables. Do the same with the solar input negative. Next, connect the lithium house battery positive to the out plus port. It is recommended to fuse this line. The DC-DC MPPT should then turn on the service battery and battery type LEDs. We will then set the battery type of the house battery by tapping the type push button. Set it to blue for lithium. The service battery indicator emphasizing status should also be a color depending on your battery voltage. The DC-DC MPPT uses a voltage sensitive relay to start when the starter battery reaches the cut in voltage, depending on your alternator type. You will continue by connecting the starter battery positive to the Alt Plus port. Fusing is recommended on this line. Only solar or only alternator will allow you to reach the max rated amps from a single source. In this example, we will connect both alternator and solar. Solar prioritizes house battery charging and alternator prioritizes starter battery charging for a dual charging system. Complete your setup by connecting your 100 watt panel positive to the PV plus port. Two sources are limited to a 50-50 amp split for a total up to the rated amps of the charger. When done correctly, turning on the vehicle will start charging the starter battery until it reaches the cut in voltage before charging the house lithium battery. The Alt, PV, and battery status LEDs will communicate charging state. To optimize your system, you can take advantage of these accessories. You have successfully set up your DC-DC MPPT charger. Now you can charge your starter and deep cycle battery from your vehicle's alternator and solar input simultaneously. We hope this video has helped familiarize yourself with Renogy's DC-DC MPPT charger. For any other questions regarding this unit, please give our support team a call. You can find our contact information below. Thank you for your purchase and have a wonderful day.